Welcome, welcome to Growing in Faith with G.P. Crane fam. So faith comes from hearing that is hearing the good news about Christ. Today we're going to take you back to the book of John on Christ, the eternal word. Amen. Remember, follow the Growing Faith with G.P. Crane fam and share the life and the light of men, which is the word of God. Amen. In the beginning, the word already existed. The word was with God and the word was God. He existed in the beginning with God. God created everything through him and nothing was created except through him. The word gave life to everything that was created and his life brought light to everyone. The light shines in the darkness and the darkness can never extinguish it. God sent a man, John the Baptist, to tell about the light so that everyone might believe because of his testimony. John himself was not the light. He was simply a witness to tell about the light. The one who is the true light, who gives light to everyone, was coming into the world. He came into the very world he created, but the world did not recognize him. He came to his own people, and even they rejected him. But to all who believe him and accept him, he gave the right to become children of God. They are reborn and not with a physical birth resulting from human passion or plan, but a birth that comes from God. So the word became human and made his home among us. He was full of unfailing love and faithfulness. And we have seen his glory, the glory of the father's one and only son. John testifies about him when he shouted to the crowds. This is the one I was talking about when I said someone is coming after me who is far greater than I am. For he existed long before me. For his abundance, we all have all received one gracious blessing after another. For the law was given through Moses, but God's unfailing love and faithfulness came through Jesus Christ. No one has ever seen God, but the unique one who is himself God is near to the Father's heart. He has revealed God to us. John 1, 1 through 18, 11 translation. I fall to my knees and pray to the Father, the creator of everything in heaven and on earth, I pray that from his glorious unlimited resources, he will empower you with inner strength through his spirit. Then Christ will make his home in your hearts as you trust in him. Your roots will grow down into God's love and keep you strong. And may you have the power to understand as all God's people should, how wide and how long, how deep his love is may experience the love of Christ though it is too great to understand fully and you will be made complete with all the fullness of life and power that comes from God now now a glory to God who is able through his mighty power